everybody and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Alive. Had a little bit of a of a mic upgrade here. Well, maybe it's not really an upgrade. It's kind of more of a downgrade. <laughs> but I've, I've just been needing uh, like a, a better setup for my mic because for the longest time it's been overarching my, my, my what do you call it, uh, monitor. So it's been like really far away and uh, it's it's led to some weird weird uh i don't know what you call it uh just some audio things where sometimes it's really loud sometimes it's really quiet so hopefully this time i should be okay um hopefully going forward as well this is gonna i don't know if you guys have seen bro gaming i recently uh posted in case anybody wants other content you want to hear beaver swear <gasps> uh mainly just because i'm playing with friends it's not a case of like on here i'm like no I don't, I don't swear in real life. I don't do that. <laughs> Why are we in Jurassic World Alive? Well, you should know if you play this game, there has been an update. Um, a kind of a big update and not a big update. So first things first, right off the bat, um, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna set out a giga cent. Um, I think there was something, uh, and I'll show you what. Ooh, I'll get that. I'll get that. Yes. We're doing a weird episode today because we're actually going to be looking at progressing the game. Um, rather than, oh, we're doing battles um, and stuff like that. So we put out a Giga Cent because I'm hoping I can snag one or two uh, epics while this um, while we do this video. Um, so the update came, and what did the update bring? Um, well, it brought, instead of like a new creature that they normally do, or new hybrids, you know, something that kind of, it does add to the game. Um, and I would, I would also argue that you could kind of say that it's fluff in a way, um, but I guess not really. So what I like to do usually every day um, is I'll put a giga cent and then a cent and then a giga cent and then a cent and then a giga cent. And that way, you know, if I'm playing for a short period of time, I can quickly, you know, get two, four, six, seven, eight dinosaurs like bam, 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 and just see what I get. Eggs, yes. So we now have um, badges. So if we click on the badge, so you get this. 49, 40, that's a weird number of badges to have, isn't it? 49 badges, and you can also switch to the legendary icons, um, which in a, in a way is another another um, interesting thing uh, to see who's inactive, because the people who are inactive won't have uh, have changed their icons to badges. So there you go, it's an easy way to clear up. But not only that, but you get titles as well. Uh, 70 to collect. I haven't, I've only collected, I think, maybe two of these. So normally you have daily missions and you have alliance uh, missions as well. But now you have achievements. You have 344 achievements to get. Um, the interesting thing when it comes to this is that it doesn't show you all of them. You can't scroll 344. You can only show you so many. Um, but some of them are, I, are like, I do not know how I'm ever going to unlock. And it says it's locked. So I don't exactly know what I'm supposed to do with that, Ludia. Uh, does that mean I'm never going to get the 200, you know, or collect 5,000 or more coin? Locked. What do you mean? Locked. <laughs> Maybe it's a case of that I have to collect these first. One of the big things is there is unique things uh, locked in the achievements. And people, of course, are like, okay, how do I get these? Because I need them now. Um, and one of the best ones here is an actual emote. And there's been a bunch of emotes uh, posted. If I have a look, because they did send me an email. Uh, International Explorer. Spin five special event supply drops uh, to unlock it. And it's a crying Dilophosaur emoji. So I should have that because I've definitely done that. Um, I'm trying to think what an event one is. Anyway, so we'll collect this. So I don't know what that was. Oh, they keep on. Okay, do they keep on going up? Right, gotcha. So they do reach player level four. So there you go. Reach. Oh, oh okay. Well, I guess we're just going to keep on clicking. So complete campaign chapter one. Well, we've definitely done that. Um, so that is. Oh, look, we got a badge. We got so many. Okay, let's just go through all these. New. Yep, get that. Uh huh. Unlock a fallen kingdom arena. Yeah, I've got that. Um, I like how it tells you. Look at all this. I get in. Look at all the stuff we're getting. Yes. Ten bucks. Oh, I'll take that. Some more stowaway, DPG trainer, uh, night critter. Ooh, I like that. 50 bucks for that one. Good lord. Also, if you go in the description below, you'll be able to find uh, a link to collect books in game. Uh, is that balance? Well rounded. Ooh. ACU officer. 100 bucks. I'd love, oh, pardon my prowess. Ooh. 
Okay, so this is Mud Fighter. So this is reaching all the different uh, arenas. Um, DPG Professional. <laughs> oh, that's me. Uh, Jurassic Rings. Right, we got we got a ways to go. The main. <laughs> Lockwood Estate. Philanthropist. Uh, chapter 7. Okay. Wanted dead or alive. Uh, well, we, I wonder how much we're going to be able to unlock here. DPG Expert. Lockwood Library. Wise guy. Um, I wonder because I'm wondering if this is just generally checking my data because i have almost got well, i think i got all the way to the end um and i got there for one battle <laughs> that was it but i don't think so i think it's probably just since this update went uh, so oh wait maybe not gyrosphere on a roll maybe it isn't Ooh, will i be able to get that no i think that's it okay so it has i have been to gyrosphere and it has selected that but i did get higher i got one higher uh win 10 battles okay 10 bucks oh what do we have here? Look at this! We just got free incubator, guys. Uh, I was gonna say, can I can I collect it? Thank you. <laughs> Win a hundred battles. I was wondering. I thought that was like a fetus. I didn't know what that was, but okay, claw. I'll hell yeah, I'll take that. Twenty, I'll take that as well. Five hundred battles. Oh god. So it must be it must be collecting all the data in my game then. Okay, so let's have a check. Do we have anything else? No, we don't. Okay, so back to collecting. Uh, launch three drones. Ooh, launch a drone over one epic creature. Launch a drone over one rare creature. Ten direct hits from a drone. <laughs> oh, this is great. 50 direct hits, another 20 bucks. Uh, 250 hits, a 50 buck. 200 darts, a thousand. Oh, what's that one? Oh, it's just a, is that a, is that just a regular scent? Okay. Oh, we got a badge coming. Have six creatures level six or more. We're going to be here a while, guys, and I like it because we're getting a lot of books. Oh, another 50. We got hundreds. Oh, we got a badge. I didn't even know what that was for, but I collected. Uh, discover five creatures. So we're also going to go over some of the more secret because um, with achievements, they don't tell you how to unlock them, or at least with some of them, they don't. They don't. Um, and some of them are more highly, I don't know, you, you'd want, especially with the emo uh, pointing down. Um, have 20 creatures level 11. In your collection. Oh, yes. I kind of want to do... Uh, I want to throw up something just to see what my difference in books is once I've collected all this. Because this is crazy. <laughs> I have three hybrid creatures. I have ten hybrid creatures. Yes! That's, that's got to be like 300 bucks there. Ludia have basically just given away to the people who play the game. Well, there's 50, 60, 70 bucks per like thing there. I have three hi rare hybrids. 750, 500, 250. Oh, some toys. Get in. And this is, have one epic creature in your collection. Only one and you get this? That's impressive. I'll take that. Anything new? Anything new? No, no, nothing new. So we'll keep on checking. Oh, there we go. So my alliance, what we're doing is if you just want to throw away uh, or want to give away coin, you basically just ask for a Gallimimus. And I, I can't remember how many times now. I've just went Gallimimus. I, I don't ever ask for DNA that I need. Um, it's always Gallimimus. <laughs> oh, we got a tile. Ooh, powerhouse. What's that? Ooh, okay. Powerhouse. I uh, have one super hybrid in your collection. Ooh, yes. Oh, specific ones. Oh. Have three or more rare creatures in your collection. Oh, wait. How? Hold on a minute. How come we're running low on these? This isn't good. Look at all the coin. <gasps> 50 bucks. Oh, discover two apex creatures. 25. Nice. Have three. Uh -huh. And then 10. Uh, 20. If you have 50 creatures in your collection. Oh, look at that. We got badges there. Have 75 creatures in your collection. Boom. Uh, have 100 creatures in your collection. A hundo bucks. And then here we go. Um, so some of them like launch a drone over 10 different creatures. Okay, fair enough. Oh, now it's showing me 300. Now it's showing me. So participate in three PvP season battles. Oh, is it because I haven't, I didn't have those? Ah, gotcha. So in order to unlock them, they have to be ready. Use one or more scent capsule. I've just done that. Okay, so yes, right. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So I had to, I had to basically get all those. And even then, these are all locked. They say they're completed. Oh, right. Oh, so these are the completed ones that I've just done. And what about the locked ones? Are they going to still be at the bottom? Okay, well, anyway, uh, so we need to set off another... Oh, yeah, hold on. <laughs> I've been saving this. <laughs> oh, a legendary incubator! Because I don't know whether or not there was some... Um... 
Do I have that? I didn't realize you could get emotes in just regular legendary incubators. Oh. Okay, so more DNA. Get in, get in. Um, so I will tell you how to get some of these secret emotes because I've had some very nice people um, post, like, send it to me, message me, um, all the different, like, hidden achievements because a lot of them don't show you what you need to do. And I think that's kind of good. Uh, in fact, we're going to be trying to go for one that is uh, it's definitely not something that you should just try to go for. It's more a case of... Um, ooh, there's another sloth. I'll take that. Um, it's more a case of going, uh, like, earning it over time rather than trying it or trying to go for it. Uh, we will obviously do three PvP battles because I won the other emote. That looks sweet. I've, and I've actually seen people. I'll, I'll go onto my emo um, library because <laughs> when I've been doing Apex raids, uh, people that have loads of emotes have just been like showcasing them off. So I could, I'm assuming, so, you know, it goes into my library. Um, and for the longest time, I didn't know how people were getting these emotes. I don't know whether it was through paid, um, what do you call? Oh, there you go. Oh, recognized. We did a thing. Uh, I wonder if I just spin. Are these events? These might be event uh, thingies now. I'm not exactly sure. So I'm just going to spin a bunch of these. So, um, the the one of the rare, you know, that one that's the DNA pointing down. In order to unlock the DNA pointing down uh, emote, you need to miss 50 dots. Okay, not too bad. On epic creatures i would i would say it was it will probably take you maybe even 50 creatures to do that 50 epics unless you're going for it if a if an epic creature is right next to you uh you get 15 dots max so you're talking about one two three four epic creatures that you deliberately waste dots on um if you want to just quickly go get it which to me is kind of crazy. Uh, but we're going to try and go for that. We're going to try and go for that. Also, there was an achievement for launching a drone over a rare creature. Because apparently, I haven't done that. Ever. <laughs> but in a way, I'm kind of glad that it doesn't... You know, they, it hasn't just given you all of the... Uh, oh, the music just decided to stop there. That's good. That's good game design, that is. So you can hear me more clearly. Uh, <laughs> I wonder if there's ones for just missing generally on creatures. Um, what was I saying? I can't remember what I was saying. There you go. Oh, maybe it was. Maybe I've already got that one. Who knows? Anyway, let's just spin more of these. So what I will do is put out an epic, uh, scent. Because we need to get an achievement for putting out a scent. Anyway, and we've got plenty of gigas. And there it is. That's the next one. So we could be here for the next three hours and probably never get an epic. It would be very rare. I think you'd probably, you probably would get one or two epics at least because it's happened to me before when you just cycle through them. Uh, so should we cycle through the gigas? Let's cycle through the gigas. So we'll do a regular scent change. There you go. We got that. I might as well collect that uh, while we're here in case uh, I need to. Oh, was that? You saw that? That was a lithonics thingy there. Well, I'll take that. Uh, use five or more scent capsules. Use this ability three times. Pounds. Interesting. I like it. Um, so we, before we do that, I do also want to go through some of the, uh, different achievements here. Boost ability, rampage and run against creatures, Stiggy Moloch. So there's very specific ones. Sanctuary action, play, Amargosaurus. So, sanctuary action, so you have to do their play. 20 times maybe collect a uh, unique a thousand dna defeat tyrannosaurus with velociraptor uh, some other ones are defeat tyrannodon with armor or whatever that is uh <laughs> defeat creatures with gorgosuchus discover three unique creatures use boost speed on 20 creatures uh use emote tyrannosaurus rex 45 times or i'm assuming that's what that is uh collect dna rare 220 or two yeah 25,000 dna rare uh fusion dna 90 plus amount uh so then i'm guessing these are all been from like a hack inside the game that's why they're all weird like it's achievement underscore use emote crying 35 times so you got you <laughs> so you've, when you're in a battle we're just gonna spam the crying emote 25 times. Should we try and do that to somebody? Uh, hopefully we can get an epic. Um, if it is a good epic, however, like a woolly rhino or anything like that, I don't think I'm just going to waste it. I apologize. I'm not, I'm not going to waste a woolly rhino DNA.
Right, maybe we can't get this one. Because I'm trying to think, because I want to do the battles, but a battle's going to last more than two minutes, which means if we even do set out the epic incubator, uh, sorry, scent, whatever you want to call it, um, chances are that we're going to miss something uh, while we're doing a battle. So let's let's go ahead and do a battle. Show. So we need to do crying emoji. Okay, not the best team to start out with. Uh, you know, I'll just go for Dio. Is that a Dio? Um... Win battle tournament utilizing the thorn axe. A battle tournament utilizing the thorn axe. So we just got to go for crying emote loads of times. Um, I was trying to think what's the best case scenario here. I might as well just shield. Uh, let's keep on. Let's keep on crying. Hopefully they've got emotes turned off. So it doesn't seem like we're spamming. Uh, so that's three. Yeah, it was a good job putting that shield up, I suppose. Or was it? Because he's probably, yeah, he's going to kill me in one hit. <laughs> one more hit. So keep on crying. Oh, he's got it. He's got that one. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. He's, he's definitely going to win this. This was a terrible loadout for me. The only good dinosaur I have there is basically my uh, Magnetator. Because every... Not unboosted Dio. Unboosted Draco. And it's only Hadro, I suppose, which is good. Um, I guess we just keep... We just got to keep on crying as much as we can. Just cry, cry, cry. There we go. Keep on crying. Look at this. This Ardentus is perfect for this team. <laughs> I do not have Mortem Rex or anything that can just like bite through it straight away. Um, actually, it's not too bad. I am quicker, which is interesting because it even is speed boosted, but I'm just quicker. Keep on crying. I need to get the secret emo. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if it looks like I'm spamming. I apologize. Oh, that's interesting. I mean, I'm wondering what he could do here because I'm going to, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to reduce him there. Um, and then I could just go for... Oh, yeah, I've gone for that. Sweet! So it doesn't matter what he does here. I'm going to get health. Right, okay. I, I'm so sorry. Uh, go man aside. <laughs> yeah, he's going to go for cleansing. And so he is going to do some damage. And I don't know whether I've gained more health or lost more health there. He's going to keep on crying. He's going to be like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> cry, cry, cry. We need the secret achievement. It seems like during a turn or a phase, it has a has a cooldown. I guys, you gotta keep an eye on how many times am I doing Oh no, there it was! Okay, so he's probably gonna kill me. Yeah, he, Whoa, he's gotten even more boosted um thingy, but I am quicker, so I will I will, I will switch to Draco Rex. <laughs> this guy's be like, is he what's he doing? Is this guy broken? <laughs> Yes, come on, count to me, you bugger you. Oh, he's killed me. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. You have none boosted Draco Rex against a proper boosted team. Um, so what do we go for here? Um, I'm really trying to think. I am faster than him, but I will go for Magnetator. Imagine if this isn't like a thingy. I mean, chances are, right, he's just going to go for a Resilient Rampage. And then he's just going to kill me. Because he's going to do like 4,000 damage. Factoring in this hit. Um, so I'm, I'm almost dead. Yeah, I'm, I'm almost dead. Um, I'm surprised I've done so well actually. To get like a two creature kill. Now he d he's lost his Draco Rex, right? He lost his Draco Rex. So I may as well just go for a, a thingy hit. Um, it doesn't make... Oh, he's just... Okay, that's good. That's good. He's making it last longer. Which means I can get more crying emotes off. Brilliant. He is. <laughs> Oh, whoops. No, I'm dead. No. <laughs> right. We're probably going to need to do another battle. That was an awful team. I'm trying to get somewhere with my team. I'm trying to like level up Mono, Mono Ryan. Mono Ryan. I mean, this is my team at the moment. I'm, there's definitely a few dinosaurs that I switch out for. I've heard a lot of people say that I, I should switch out Earl of Dominus for Earl of Spix. Can I fuse 20? No, I can't. I'll get fuse five more. I, I'll, yeah, I'll definitely do it. So that's a hundred. I think I need a thousand unique DNA to actually get that mission. So we'll, we'll do a little bit more. Um, I'm just wondering what other unique DNA I could get. I could probably just fuse Thordor if I need to get that. I don't know what the, I think it was a thousand unique. Um, but seeing, you know what? We may as well fuse a little bit for this. There you go. Surprise development. That was probably get 500 legendary uh, DNA there. Um, so we'll switch back to Erla Spix. The only problem with switching... Oh, God. I was about to... I was about to fuse it there. The only... Oh, 90! We got 
got a freaking 90 on that bad boy. Damn. That was good. <laughs> uh, let's have a look at our achievements. What what exactly did we get? Receive 90 or more hybrid DNA in one fusion. Oh, and receive 50 or more. Not bad. Not bad. So use five or more sand capsules. So one more. And we get that. Use three abilities. Yes. Complete three strike towers. So a lot of these unlock arena 13 and nublar shores. Oh, another sloth. Need to get another sloth. Also, it has been... Well, last time I got my hair cut was last year. So this is, well, like three months of growth. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> so I apologize if I look a bit... Not, not well kept on me hair. I just don't want Whitney to cut it, really. I mean, a lot of these are only going to be, be, like, applicable for the, the tournaments or, like, the skill arenas and stuff like that. So... You can't re win a battle tournament using the Thornax as well. Mm. Okay, so what do we get? Well, we need to start off with our classic crying emote. Um, okay, you can do that one. That's fine. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... Hold on. I've just gotta wait. I apologize. I like how we got different colors now, so their emote background is red. Um, I apologize. I need to keep crying. Um, so I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Come on, one more. I mean, actually, I'd probably start with Utaranex anyway, so... You know what? Let's start with Dio. Dio, who did, who is completely unboosted. Actually, not not a bad matchup. Not a bad... I mean, it is. If I wasn't a boot... If I was a boosted Dio, it would be a good matchup, I suppose. Because I'm not boosted. Oh, yeah, more crying. More crying. Need to keep on crying. There we go. So now he's just going to wreck me. Um, but that's okay. Because I am... Utaranex is faster than uh, him. So that means I can easily kill him next round. Um, so I might as well just go for a hit. Yeah, I thought that was going to come through. Oh, and he gets the... Don't yawn at me. I need to cry. <laughs> you fool. You don't realize I go for a secret achievement. <laughs> so much cries. Yeah, okay. That's not too bad. Actually allows... Oh, when I get a crit on a... Fu oh, it's 20% chance. Never mind. Um, yeah. It's not It's not bad. Utoronix actually gets to set up, I suppose. Uh, is resistant to... Uh, mm. Now, what do I do f here? I think I'm tempted to just get, run and get out of here. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. In this situation, my Earl of Dominus isn't isn't better than my Utaranex. Utaranex is way better. He's probably going to go for Resilient. I thought that was going to be the case. Yeah, I'm definitely slower. Um, so I'm just, <laughs> just focusing on going for these. Uh, what I could do, actually, sod it. Let's just switch out and kill him. <laughs> just get Draco Rex. Just get Draco Rex in there. Oh, he swaps out as well. Interesting. Okay, okay. I mean, I guess. Ah, uh, his, uh, not Utaranex. What do I call this? Oh, Quetzal. Quetzal. Quetzal Orion. This is pretty decent. And that would have been a good... Does he resist it? I think he does resist the uh, render. He does resist the render. Um, does, is he resisting the stun? No, he's not. Okay, so we'll go for a... Uh, we'll go for the stun. Uh, we'll just keep on crying. <laughs> we'll go for the stun. Um, now we can just go for a big hit here, I suppose. Or a cleanse. Eh, yeah, may as well just go for a big hit. Who cares at this point? <laughs> Bam! Hey, Draco Rex can actually do something, even if he is unboosted. Um, what else is going to happen? You can't really speed up. Um, hold on. Yeah, there we go. We need more cries. More cries. More cries. Not enough cries. More. Botto. Uh, so what, what, what can we see happen here? He goes for a... Hmm... Yeah, I mean, he's pretty much won this. There's, like, again, my team isn't the best. And I'm <laughs> I basically just do battles just to get the uh, incubators. So he'll go for his sidestep. Yeah, who didn't see that coming? Um, yeah, the reason why I haven't got early Spix in replace of Illidominus Rex is because my early, my early Dominus, sorry, has a bunch of, um, like, boosts on it. Um, now, because he's faster, he could actually go for a sidestep and predict my instant charge. Sorry, I've got loads of speed boosts and I can't take them off Illidom. Sorry if I've uh, mentioned that a million times and never got to the root of the story. Uh, so he does swap, which is interesting. He's probably going to be faster. No, he's not faster. Oh, that's weird. Uh, okay. 
I can't. Mm, 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 mm. What could I go for here? I guess I could go for that. He probably could go for a cloak. Yeah, I suppose. Uh, hopefully I get lucky here and go through it, uh, which I don't. Um, and I will need a crit. To, or I will need to just go through him here. Ah, oh, I get that crit, but I don't go through him. I had less chance of... Uh, look at him yawning. <laughs> I'm sorry, if you, if you yawn in this day and age of friggin' Jurassic World Alive. There it is! Balling brawler, yes! <laughs> we got the achievement. Send this emote 35 times. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. We got a secret achievement. And he had no idea. I just got coin from him. <laughs> so we'll do one more ballerina because we can get the free one. But, oh, hold on, hold on. I need to cancel. We might have got an epic. Have we got an epic? Survey says... No. Can we make a hat trick of losses? We don't have the T-Rex emote. Oh, I also... Uh, rem I'll try and remember. Sorry. I'll try and remember and show what emotes I've been shown so you guys at least can see what there are. Um, I don't even know if I've seen all of them. I assume I haven't. I'm sure there's probably loads. Again, why every every time a Dio? Why every time a Dio? <laughs> why is that a... Oh, freaking Argentinosaurus as well. Sorry, Ardentus Maxima. Oh, God. This is the perfect... Com I might as well just go for a hit. I might as well. Hopefully, it's slower than my Mortem. 125 speed. I actually don't think it is. I think it might be faster. That is one beastie Ardentus. Um, no. Would you look at that? It isn't. Jesus. Um, it's actually, I'm really tempted just to put in. Yeah, I'm really tempted just to put in that. Now what? Um, mm, mm, mm. I was hoping I could cleanse and then switch back out to Dio and he would go for a little hit and then I would be able to get a counter off, but he's going to go for a big hit. And then even then, I can't switch. What is the attack on this thing? It can't be too... It's about 2,000. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. I can't do anything. So he's got... No matter what happens here, he's going to go for a big hit. Switching to Drake. Like, is there another one that can... Can I just keep sending like... Uh, the the goat emoji is that like a is that a thingy? I can just keep on doing for goat emoji. <laughs> Does he get slowed? I don't think he can get slowed. No, he can't. Okay, so may as well just go for that one. He's gonna go for the biggest. Oh, he didn't. But why? I mean, I guess it makes no difference because they both do the same amount of damage, I suppose. Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> So what, I mean, I'd love to know what other ones there are, what other secret uh, achievements. Hold on, here we go. We've got another one. Create super hybrid 20. Use emote to run Yeah, we've seen that one. Uh, oh, it's the same. Is it the same? Or did I just click on a different one? Uh, we need to feed in the sanctuary. We need to play in the sanctuary. Um, but yeah, there's loads. And the T-Rex alone is a, is a crazy one. Um, right. I am tempted here. I don't want to hurt him. I just kind of want to... Like, he's got a boosted Dio, so he knows what he's doing with this guy. Um, and I definitely don't really want to hit him because I'm being hit with 3,000 next turn. Um, but there isn't much I can really do. I think I've got to go for the risk and go for, like, just doing as much damage to him as possible um, this turn. And then allowing my Mortem Rex to... Oh, sorry, it's basically a Mortem Rex, right? Is it? Is it? Yeah, it is Mortem. Is it Mortem? I'm thinking of Mega. I get confused between the two games. Uh, I may as well just, like, do damage here. Send out Mortem Rex. Go for a big hit. And then no matter what comes in, I'm probably going to kill it in one hit if I get a crit. So it's, it's now 50-50. Oh, there's a crit. So it's 6,200. If I get a crit with my biggest hit... That's like 7,000 damage. So chances are he's going to go for a cloak here. And then... So it's, this is it. If he does cloak, I have a 33% chance of hitting him. And if I do, I kill him. So here comes a cloak. Yep, this is it. This It's all in... It's all... Like, even if I don't get a crit, I've killed him. I just need the 30 odd percent chance to go through, get the crit, and unfortunately, there goes the game. <laughs> That's unfortunate. <laughs> Did you get the crit as well, though? Oh, I got a 40% chance for a crit. Oh, but I just didn't get through the cloak. Oh, that is a shame. But that also means that we have gotten the 
Uh, wait, wait, what was that? Goat stuff. Oh, there was a secret achievement for that. Uh, send emotes with this three times goat. <laughs> so that's 10. And we also get... <gasps> the Brachiosaurus is a secret achievement. Why oh, like that. How did they get those? Did they buy them in the incubators? And now the ones that you buy in the incubators you had to buy are now free as achievements. If that's the case, I feel so sorry for you guys who've spent money thinking, you know what? If it's only exclusive to the incubators... I'll do it. So sorry for you. <laughs> that, that, that sucks. But it's not the first time that we've seen uh, Ludia or, you know, do something where something's locked behind a paywall. And then all of a sudden it's not locked behind a paywall. Or, you know, they're charging like a hundred pound for it, basically. <laughs> um, but let's have a look, because I did say before I would go. Um, let's have a look at my emotes, because we have two extra ones. So that, this is all I have at the moment. So we did just unlock. Oh, maybe I didn't have the, sh the shrug. Oh, I like that. Um, now, I'll, I guess I'll switch out that. And I like the buff one. What should we... We'll go for the... I like the dodo. The dodo is nice. We're going to switch out for the heartbreak. But the other ones that I have seen... Um, I've seen so there's a Carnotaurus, Cor <laughs> Carnotaurus firework one. The, yeah, the Dilophosaurus crying one. It doesn't, does it tell you how to get them? No, it doesn't. So you got the T-Rex there, you got the goat. Thumbs down one. Somebody actually already has missed 50 shots on an epic. <laughs> but there is still a, a plethora of different ones that we need. Um, but then we go, so now we have the shrug and we have the buff one. Uh, have we got an epic? No, we still don't have a flipping epic. Well, guys, that's going to have to wrap this video. Uh, we've done some battles. We've shown how to get some secret uh, achievements. Hopefully, I'll put up the images. If you just want to pause the video, you can have a look through of other ones uh, that you'd like. Uh, credit and shout out to uh, David. Um, I think David Bordeaux, who sent me those. A verb, verbio, <laughs> my bad, uh, who sent me those. Um, and if you also know any other secret achievements, leave them down in the comments below. Because I'm sure people would like to just... who People have already watched this video and have already scrolled just having a look anyway. Um, but yeah, I don't think there's anything wrong with spoiling them. I think it's part of... You know, even me, who's, you know, level 20, who's played this game since it was released can still have something to work towards. Um, if you would rather have it as, you know, you didn't know about those things. Um, I mean, there's nothing really too spoilery. If we have a look at what, so through collecting all those, what badges do I have? Um, yeah, not bad. And legacy, not legacy icons. We want to have a look at titles because we've got a look. On a roll. I think we should have on a roll for the amount of losses that we've done. <laughs> I'm on a roll for losses. That's brilliant. That's, it's a nice touch. If anything, it just... It, it, it fleshes out the game a little bit more that you've got more achievements and more stuff. Because I think achievements were always there, but or at least they, they were added for one thing. But if you maxed up, you'd basically gotten everything. So there was no need to have achievements. But now you've got, I mean, how many have I got now? I've got 96 out of 344. This is probably going to tide me over for the next few months, which is really nice. There's something to unlock, you know, because this game's very grindy. It's like, oh, the daily missions, up oh, the alliance thing, and then the tournament, and then the apex raids. Repeat until you're dead, or until the game gets discontinued, like Jurassic Park Builder. We're looking at you, Ludia. Because <laughs> uh, it will happen. All the money you spend in this game will eventually go. Eventually, this game will be shut down, just like Jurassic Park Builder. So just bear that in mind when you do spend money on it. As long as you're, you know, you'll get in the short term, you know, not, you get the creatures, you enjoy it. But eventually, it will be gone. It's not like a game that you have your whole life, and you know, even then, it's it's is any does anything last forever? Not really. You could buy a game when you were a kid, and it's probably stopped working by now, even if you did have the console, or whatever. But oh, a Spinosaurus! I'll take that. That's for me, early spicks. I'll need that. <laughs> oh. I, the thing is, I do need to take off uh, all the speed boosts from my Erlodom. I just don't really want to do that because... Oh, now we got the music working, but we don't have the sound effects working. Oh, that's brilliant. <laughs> it's interesting that the emo for the, the Dilophosaurus seems like a T-Rex, just they put frills on it. It would be nicer if they made it like more dilophosaurus -y. But then again, when it comes to emotes, you don't want to put too much detail in them. You need them kind of simple because they're small. Especially, I mean, I know that, you know, from a Discord server and stuff, you see all these people make these really intricate um, emotes. But then when you see it, it's like, 
Huh? <laughs> what is that? You need something simple to work. So I understand that. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, third time we're doing the outro, leave a like. Don't forget, description below, uh, collect your books, open the app in, oh, sorry, watch this video in the device or on the device that you um, play the game on. Click on that link. It should take you to the game. Make sure it's closed before you click on the link and you'll get 50 free books. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, fourth time, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.